Hello and howdy, friends. Um, I just put the game back in progressive scan mode. Now I need to move the screen down a tiny bit. But I seem to have lost my remote. Help. Bro, how did I... Oh, it's right in front of me. I'm just blind as hell. All right. There we go. Da, 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 da. Scaling. Oh, not horizontal position. Vertical position. There we go. That's better. All right. Hello. Hey, Nate. Hey, Noodle. Welcome, friends. I'm excited to hop back in God of War after missing last week. Excited to be finishing it up, too. No idea what we're going to end up playing next, but... Oh, my God. <laughs> that was that was a way to start, man. As soon as the game loads up, just screaming. Okay. Good stuff. Apparently, we're in hell. Good to know. Uh, <laughs> as per usual, I don't remember a whole lot, even more so now because of the, the delay or the skip, whatever you want to call it, from last week to this week, but it's fine. Does it matter which way we go here? I don't remember. I think it's probably fine. Well, there's a chest here, so we definitely want to grab that. Of course. Oh, man. How are things going for you guys today? I know how Noodle's doing, but how are you, Nate? And uh, Metabolic Atrium, I know the bot said thank you, but I also would like to say thank you, my guy, for the follow. I don't believe you got your snow day you were hoping for, Nate, which uh, sucks, but, <laughs> but other than that, I hope everything's going well for you, bud. Oh, oh okay, that was, that was sketch. We're fine, though. Everything's great. Is there anything over here? Nope, I guess not. Well, that was a massive waste of time, then. I love all the falling bodies. Just, <laughs> just falling and screaming. Oh god, I forget how to play. <laughs> What's block again? L1, okay. This is dodge roll. Alright, we're good. We got this. It's it's been a little while. What's the Okay, that's that's switching swords. What's the what's the button for magic? That's not it! <laughs> Holy shit. How don't I there we go, okay. L2. <laughs> This is what happens, man. I go one week without playing a game, and I just forget absolutely everything about it. It's good stuff. It's <laughs> Alright, these guys weren't even, like, particularly strong. I just... Suck. If I can keep you guys juggled, that would be fantastic. Nope. Well... That was not the move I wanted to do. It's fine. How are you not dead? One of you, I think it's this one that I'm attacking here, was already like in its grab state once. Maybe not though. Uh, maybe I'm just crazy. I'm probably just crazy. Or are these... These are clones of that, that one dude that has, like, two uh, grab states, now that I think about it. They have, like, the one that just damages them and then the one that actually kills them. Because they probably just weren't as far as I thought they were. Is there anything over here? No. Nothing? chest please yeah I'm pretty sure we're all done with the like uh, Gorgon eyes and Phoenix feathers and all that crap problem is like I don't remember where we're meant to be going so I can't remember which way to go to collect all of the, the goodies, all of the stuff. Let the 
Oh god. That was I was so scared, man. I thought we were gonna fall off. We're fine. The game wants to give us a health chest though, that'd be nice. It's going, got extra to do at work with parent teacher conferences coming up. Ah yeah. I didn't know it was that time of year or anything, but it makes perfect sense though that that would give you extra work. Extra work in like a good way though, or in like a bad way? Like extra work that you really don't want to be doing? Or extra work it helps the day go by faster, you know? What are we what are we looking at here? Army of Hades is already at max. Blades of Chaos and Poseidon's Rage are at max. I guess we could do the Blades of Artemis, although I basically never use it. I think we might do Medusa's Gaze. Because having the, the Insta Freeze could be handy in some situations. But you have stakes, so that's good? Hell yeah, man. That's. I haven't. Oh god, that was. Bad. We like touched the side of that blade. That was that was garbage. We didn't even touch the blade part of the blade, but damn if it didn't almost kill us. Um anyways, yeah, Noodle and I have some steaks too in the freezer. We just haven't gotten around to really cooking them yet. But one of these days. Like, extra stuff that sets me behind. Okay, so not not keeps you busy, but actually, like, actively sets you behind. Yeah, that sucks. Please don't die. I could really use a health chest. If the game wants to give me one of those somewhere, that would be fantastic. Thank you, Solitary Basset, for following. Solitary Basseb. Yeah, thank you, my guy. Appreciate the follow, man. What are you planning on doing with your steak, Nate? Anything fancy with it or just, like, frying it up? You having some potatoes with it? Personal favorite? Pierogies, man. Pierogies and steak are, like, god-tier combination with some sort of vegetable. I don't particularly care the kind of vegetable, but... Gotta have some kind of vegetable on the side, too. Probably shouldn't really worry about leveling up and all that right now. Because there's a good chance we're going to die here in a minute. But, <laughs> oh, well, we'll do it anyways. Ah, with mushrooms, too, of course, yes. Gotta have the mushrooms. Mushrooms are A tier. Oh, oh, oh. Mushroom, fried up mushrooms and onions on the side, man. Hmm. Found decent sirloin for 11 bucks. Had part for your dinner and part for lunch. Nice, man. Yeah. We just, <laughs> we're just big fans of pierogies and mushrooms and all that in general in this house. So, like, <laughs> pierogies, mushrooms, onions, all, all really good stuff. No. I got greedy. <laughs> I got greedy. Oh my god. <laughs> we spawned in getting murdered. That was great. Thanks for that game. Now the real question is, where am I? Bro, I do not remember where I'm at at all right now. And of course we have no camera control. Okay, well we apparently haven't gone this way yet. Do you want to give us some health when I throw you by any chance? Thanks, guy. Going for greed. We're fine. We got it. We got it. We'll wait to level up again, though. <laughs> Ooh, okay. It's fine. Everything's grand. These ones look like teeth. <laughs> Are they all meant to look like teeth? I don't know. But just realized the like two on the side here and there, they look like teeth to me. Some seasoning, it was a decent sized steak. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, man. It's kind of hard. 
I was gonna say it's kind of hard to mess up a steak, but I guess like I've definitely seen people do it So it's not that hard I guess actually It's like as long as you don't overcook it to hell and back and use some seasoning Then it's pretty hard to mess up a steak Bro, I didn't even realize we touched that thing Nope No health that time? That's rude. Oh. <laughs> At some point, the game's just gonna feel bad for us and give us, like, a full heal. For dying so many spot times in the same spot. Oh, oh. Honestly, I'm a little surprised that with all of these like side chests and stuff we found, none of them have been health chests or or the like pick a pick a path chests. You know, whether it's magic or health or whatever you want. Because these blades deal some damage, man. We shouldn't have taken as much damage from the actual mobs in the area, though. That was definitely my bad for being garbage when we first loaded up. Trying to remember how to play the game. I wish the uh, checkpoint would respawn. Whenever we load in, like, go and get the, the chest and then come back, that would be handy, but... Oh, God, these things? Hopefully there's not a ton of them, man. We've done our time with these things. We've struggled enough with them. I really don't want to deal with them at all, <laughs> but <laughs> it doesn't appear as though I have a choice. As long as they're not going to start dive bombing, it's fine. Hopefully there's not like a spawn of them. Like an infinite spawn of them. Got nice here, cooked a medium rare. Season was just classic onion, garlic. Oh, I got scared. Black pepper, salt, and a little bit of brown sugar. Ew. You had me up until the brown sugar. <laughs> uh, not a fan of uh, sugar on my steak. Okay, we probably missed a path somewhere. Is it worth going back? There's probably a checkpoint right here. Okay, yeah. So we're gonna grab the health, hit the save point, and then I'm gonna go back real quick and make sure we didn't miss any chests. Even if we did, it's probably not an important chest, but it's gonna bug me leaving it back there. Unsearched. We do need to be kind of careful about taking too much damage, though, because there's probably a boss fight or something after uh, after that save point. And since the game just gave us health, it's not like it's going to give us health again before then, so... Oh, God. Didn't... Grab them. Grab them all. Please grab them. <laughs> Bro, how'd you miss that grab, though? Put some more shara on it after it rested. So more or less like a uh, like a barbecue, which is fine, I guess. But nah, I'm a I'm a dry steak kind of guy, man. As far as my seasoning, I don't tend to put wet sauces on it, unless it's like a pan sauce or something, you know, from the drippings while cooking it. I might throw that on top of it, maybe, but... Doesn't add too much sweetness to say if you don't overkill, but it really helps with like a grill like sear. Yeah, I mean, sugar, that's where the Maillard reaction comes from, or at least it comes at a lower temperature than proteins do, right? So, like, I get what you're saying, 
but I don't care if it adds next to no sweetness. That's too much sweetness for me added to the steak. <laughs> I don't want I don't want no sugar on my steak. But that's just me. You obviously like it, so good for you, man. Do it and enjoy it. That's all that matters. Alright. Did it without taking damage even. I'm proud. I mean, it's not like that was hard, but still, I'm proud. We didn't take damage, man. We're alive. We're going forward from the save point with a full health bar. I like it. Oh, shit. That's not block. That was just a waste of magic. Oh, my God. <laughs> Absolute garbage. And these are the ones that blow up, too, so... Holy crap, you move fast. Freaking, I hate these arrows. The ones that blow up, man. You guys suck ass. Where are you at? Come here, give me a hug. There you go, good job. You lost half a health bar from a bunch of freaking archers, man. Holy hell, that dude shot like five arrows. That was kind of sick, man. I'm not gonna lie. Good, good on ya. Oh, did we knock him off? Hell yeah. Oh my god, this thing's gonna blow up. Okay, we're good. Okay, that appears to be blocked off. You appear to be alive, which... Not cool. Uh, I should have went up there and got that health before these dudes spawned. Why do... I'm guessing the, like, AI must not have spawned for two of them, because they look completely frozen up there. Or, oh, it's just one dude. Never mind. He's not in cheaper cuts. Certain cuts I wouldn't also. That's one of the biggest factors of paralysis, isn't it? I mean, like I said, fair enough, man. If you like it, that is literally all that matters. You could put fucking, I don't know, what's something super weird to put on state? You could put a bunch of uh, spaghetti sauce <laughs> on your steak. If you enjoy it, doesn't matter, man. All that matters, literally all that matters is that you enjoy it. Okay, I need the health. Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? I was specifically trying to get health from you, my bro. It's fine. There's a health chest there. I was just hoping to get some health from these guys so that I could use that chest for some uh, magic refill, you know? Because our magic meter is very low as well, but it's fine, I guess. Is it circle? I think it's circle, right? This is what happens, man. No pen or anything. Just talking about the way I like making steaks. Fair. Like I said, I'm super basic with my men. Salt, pepper, garlic powder. Uh, I do like putting MSG on mine because I'm a big fan of MSG. Maybe onion powder, depending on how I'm feeling. And then sear it, and if it's not cooked all the way through after a high temp sear, then throw it in the oven and let it slow cook to come up to temp. Like, specifically, yeah, trying to hit that dude with it. Did we knock him off again? I think we did. Oh, I thought we knocked him off again. That would have been perfect, man. <laughs> he does not want to get knocked off again. He's like, the one time is enough. No more knockoff for you. Uh, 
over here sound like a T-Rex and shit. I have also sous vide steak before. Sous vide steak's pretty good, or sous vide, I don't really know how it's pronounced, but you put it in a bag and you boil it. <laughs> Not literally boil it, but you let it slowly come up to temp. In a water bath, that's the exact temp you want it to come up to. That's a really good method, IMO. You just gotta make sure that you dry it a little bit and you sear it on a super high heat because otherwise it's gonna overcook. Because the water bath should bring it up to exactly whatever temp you want it at, so... Once you put it in the pan, you don't really want to add any more heat to the inside of it. But I've seen a lot of people do on like YouTube and shit is like use a blowtorch, man. Like a torch with a special radiator adapter on it <laughs> that'll just sear the hell out of it. Or um, a method that I actually can and want to try is if you know what like a charcoal chimney is, you can load it up with charcoal and uh, get the charcoal super hot, which is kind of the point of a charcoal chimney. But then instead of dumping it in the grill, you just put a grill grate on the top of it and then you sit your steak on top of that and the the chimney like concentrates all of that heat and shoots it straight up so then you get a really hot sear on the steak without a uh, without a torch and i own a charcoal chimney and i almost always have charcoal on hand so i am tempted to try that one one of these days i think that'd work really well Whenever the weather's a little bit better outside, I'll probably give it a try. Good. That wasn't too bad, man. We had a bit of a close call there for a second, but no biggie. I'm gonna take magic, because our magic's empty. Now the real question here is, are dudes gonna like come try and bug us or are we safe ow okay well <laughs> definitely not safe i thought we were clear but apparently not do we get hurt if we touch the side i wonder or is it only if we touch the blades But yeah, no. Touching the side is fine. So we just need to worry about going up without getting hit. Uh, this is bad. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. Oh, God. <laughs> Bro. That was just rude, game. <laughs> nope. I saw that happening. I was getting greedy. I'm tempted to just die. I'm just gonna die. I need I need the health refill. Just kill me, game. It should respawn us. I'm pretty sure there's a checkpoint after all those fights whenever this unlocks, so. Yeah, so we just get to open the chest and do it again. <laughs> do it with full health. Try not to fuck it up this time. Too bad. That was probably our opening right there. We can go here, maybe? Okay, that's fine. This is not fine. Oh my god, dude. Jump. That was a scary one. Nope. Jump, jump, jump. Oh, God. Okay. Everything is fine. Oh, you know what we forgot to do, though? Level up. <laughs> Not that I use Medusa's gaze all that often, but still. Might as well. 7,500 over halfway there. 
What's the next one? Gorgon Rage. 360 degrees freeze attack. That's cool, I guess. Oh, look, a magic refill. Oh, there's dudes here, though. <laughs> I thought it was giving us a refill and nobody to fight. And I was like, damn, dude, we totally wasted that one down at the bottom then, didn't we? We really not going to fight anybody else here? Just arrow dudes? This doesn't seem right. Yeah, something definitely feels off here, but I guess it's fine. I'm going to leave that chest in case we take any damage and need to come back up again. Or, like, start over again. Can we break this or anything? No. I don't know why. It just looks breakable, you know? This is requiring way more focus from me than it has any right to. This is dumb. This is dumb. I don't know what made me think I could make that when I obviously couldn't. I thought we were safe on that one. I'm not going to lie. Okay, that was an accident and super dumb. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and grab the chest, I guess. Screw it. I considered just killing myself again, but... I don't know for sure where the checkpoint is, and I'd rather not have to redo it if uh, we can help it. That's like such a tight squeeze, I don't even know if it's possible. Thank you, community. Oh, Thanks for God. Following. Bro, I'm getting my butt kicked here. This is terrible. Thank you, communal recognition. I didn't quite catch it. I'm sorry. But thank you, my guy. Oh, no. No, I don't trust any of this. All right, go for it. Jump. Probably a bit late of a start. Oh god, bro. <laughs> Why am I struggling with this? This should be the easy part. Am I just going too late? Go. My, like, pinky finger touched that, man. Okay. At this point, we actually are gonna just kill ourselves. We've lost too much health to keep that <laughs> to keep that one going. I don't know what's at the top of this. If there's going to be a fight or something. All right, we're fine. It's after this one here. I realize we lost our level up again, though. <laughs> it seems like every time I realize, hey, we should probably uh, level up. Is whenever we hit a point that there's not a checkpoint. And I die. Couldn't miss on the grab there, my guy. Dead? Everybody's dead, okay. I mean, no, we're not making it up here. Well, I was gonna say, I know we can make that one, okay. Go, 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 go. Gotta line up for me at some point. No, that does not look safe. This one, maybe? Here we go, here we go. Fallout 3? <laughs> Bro, what? <laughs> you know for a fact that's not on the list. Fallout 3. Though I would love to play it, and we will. Uh, hopefully soon. I don't know how much longer Morrowind's gonna take, but... After Morrowind, that is the plan next game. Even if Chocobo is petitioning to 
jump ahead straight to Skyrim. Oh my god, thank you. Jesus. And the game even gave us a full repo at the top. That was sweet of them. And before we fall. Alright, I'm gonna level up now, which means we're probably gonna die. And, uh... <laughs> <laughs> it will have checkpointed before the level up, because that's just how that works. <laughs> Thought that was how Chocobo may have been pushing for Skyrim? No, he's just been petitioning for it. Because <laughs> my plan is to play through the the Todd Howard. Did Todd Howard do Morwen? Or did he start with Oblivion? I don't remember. But anyways, to play through Morwen, uh, then Fallout 3 then Oblivion, then Fallout New Vegas, then Skyrim, then Fallout 4. You know, play through Oblivion to Fallout 4 in release order, Fallout 76, and Starfield to be determined, basically. Um, that was the plan. And then once we beat all of those games, because I've only beat Fallout 3 and New Vegas from that list, once we beat all of them, start doing challenge runs for the games. Uh, starting with Permadeath, and uh, maybe like other challenges mixed in with the permadeath. But yeah, <laughs> Chocobo just really doesn't like Morwen. So <laughs> so he wants us to strip, skip straight to, to Skyrim, which I get it. Morwen is uh, it's a great game, but it's very dated in a lot of ways. Its menus are very dated. The RNG on uh, like every hit is super dated. Um, yeah, it's, it's an old game, and it's clear that it's an old game. Can we make that jump? We cannot. It looked doable. Obviously, I was wrong, but it looked doable. It was close. I thought if it was like a level jump, I knew it wouldn't have been possible, but I thought it was at a bit of a height discrepancy there, you know, we had the height advantage, so I thought maybe, right, because that looks a lot higher than this one, but no, no luck. You're excited for Oblivion? I'm excited to see what Oblivion's all about, because I never gave it, like, a fair chance, I've only ever played a bit of it, but, oh no, you're the cat people, but on fire. The cat people suck. trying to get them stunned, but... Oh, didn't we find out that we can launch them into the air? Does that work for the this version of them too, or... That is not what I was trying to do. That's what I was trying to do. <laughs> Good miss on the... Oh my god, I hate these things so much. need to remember that they do that on the oh when they get up that they kick like that probably be better just to whack them honestly whenever they are launched in the air like that oh okay like every group of kills more skeletons come up out of the spinal column are they spinal columns anyways come up out of the ground there you need to kill a certain number of them there. I wish it wasn't these enemies, though. I wish it was, like, basically any other enemy. Oh, God. We can't... We can't get those chests! I thought those chests were right for the grabbing. Nope. Not yet. Props. Good block. Get the chest before I die. I can. Good. Screw it. I don't know if more powerful enemies are going to spawn or not, but... Oh my god, that sucked. I 
how do we how do we do the flash wait are you immune to it maybe they're immune to it bad time to explore new magic options man when we're dying Give me, give me your thing. Yeah, I can't take the thing because the other one keeps hitting me. Dicks. Oh my god, we're so dead. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's a fun game and the guilds in there are awesome. That was one of the main things you liked more in Oblivion versus Skyrim. That and enchanting slash magic in general. Yeah, that's the one thing like from what I've seen and heard of Oblivion that I wish they would have kept for Skyrim, right? From what I've seen of Oblivion, I think Skyrim's the better game in almost every way, except for the magic system. I feel like the magic system had a lot more going on in Oblivion than it did in Skyrim. This is completely from an outsider's perspective, though. I haven't actually played enough of the game before to have any real opinion on it, but that's how it looks. Trying to get them both launched in the air at the same time, but the bastards keep running. Oh, damn, you got range on you, bro. I like slam him into the other one that would have been sick ow that was rude okay kill these two I'm tired of them these two in particular or not Killed one of them like being in the corner can you guys go in the corner maybe oh, I didn't even get a jump up at him that was rude there we go why do they keep getting separated stay together so I can like attempt to juggle you a little bit god y'all are bastards you know that How many more do I need to kill? I am struggling. Thank God for checkpoints, man. That's all I'm saying. I missed. There we go, dude. At least they're not the dudes that, like, go into the ground and do that shit. That would really suck. Screw those guys. Cat dudes suck, but the other ones are worse. Way worse. mean to do that spinning attack all of the special moves are just death man I, I hate when I accidentally trigger them they always hurt more than they help oh you bastards I thought I had time 
we're gonna die again. I say the other one's due for a hit. Oh god. Yeah, I thought that might have been the case. Uh, let's just go ahead and... Oh. Didn't mean to click that there. What the hell? Bro, why? Yo, can someone get rid of that? For some reason, my mod stuff's not working. <laughs> Why are my mod options not working on my own channel? What the hell? There we go. Got it. That was weird. Anyways. Uh, no, not enough to power up. Oh, God. Well, we're dead. <laughs> the distraction killed us. No surprise there, I suppose. <sighs> oh, God. I'm already taking stupid hits. I almost wish more than two of them would spawn at a time. Because then I could probably use the Rage of Poseidon to kill, like, a big group of them at one time. But of course, with just two of them, that's probably why they only have two spawn at a time. That or they just decided it would be too difficult. Because, I mean, normally it's the less enemies at one time, the better. Especially for super annoying ones like this. Or if I had the Rage of the Gods right now, that would be really good too. Yeah, there's one down. I'll take it. Nice. Oh god, I got scared. Okay, this one's stunned. Uh, shit, my controller? A uh, pause game, please? No, pause? It's shit, pause and stay pause. My controller died. Oh my god, that was scary, man. That would have been bad. We're actually doing decent this time. Apparently, I need to go grab my charger. Give me just a second. Move that back. Charging? Charging. Cool. The one downside of using a wireless controller adapter for my PS2. Having to remember to recharge my controller. Which is made doubly hard by the fact it doesn't have, like, a pop-up to tell you when it's dying. I mean, how would it, right? It's a PS2. It's not meant for wireless controllers, but still. Like, it doesn't remind me to. It just dies randomly while I'm in the middle of something. Okay. Controller on. Yes. Oh, you're a bastard. Another one down. We haven't had to grab the health chest yet. That's good. No, nope, that's bad. Bad move. Oh, shit. Uh, I didn't mean to use that, but whatever. Since I did make use of it. Hey, another one dead. I'll take it, dude. Let's go. You gotta be close to dying, right? Ah, oh, bro, that was the stunning blow. You know what? 
I don't like you guys. Okay. Done them with that. Quickly grab magic. Another one down. Let's go, dudes. There can't be more than a couple left at this point. Another one down. Oh, wait. Another one's not spawning. Oh, wait. Never mind. Spoke too soon. Okay. <laughs> And before we like get knocked off somehow, die to some bullshit. Let's go. Really hoping to kill one of you while you were down. You're dead. Yep. This has to be the last two, man. They're so close at this point. It's a good thing we're having this good run, though, because this just shows that we weren't even close before. Or how'd you block, like, all of those? You know what? Damn, I was hoping to keep them both in that corner for a minute. This will work. Let's go. Jeej? Jeej. Uh, should we grab the health? Probably. Now, please don't, like, mess up one of these jumps now or something. That would be embarrassing. At least let me get a checkpoint before we die to something incredibly stupid. I don't know how useful this is going to be at this point. It doesn't seem like it could freeze those dudes we were just fighting, and I can't help but imagine whatever we come across is just going to be, you know, even more powerful. Games don't tend to get... The Earth... Games don't tend to throw less powerful creatures at you go. At you as you go. Or my head doesn't work. Okay, so that's maxed out now. So now... Hmm. I don't know. Probably Blade of Artemis. I, I just really don't care for Zeus's Fury or whatever it's called. The Lightning Bolt attack. Never really cared for it. Doesn't do anything for me. Oh, okay. I say, like, in right before the exact situation, it would actually be helpful, you know? <laughs> Getting rid of stuff like this at a distance. Okay. Empty platforms are weird. Very weird. How is there not a boss or something? Hmm. I'm surprised, man. I thought for sure something was going to try to kill us before we climbed our way out of here. I'll take it, though. How did that grave digger like dig such a deep hole, man? <laughs> like <laughs> with nothing but a shovel. That took some dedication on ah, his part. Kratos. And not a moment too soon. I only finished digging just a moment ago. Who are you? Now that is an interesting question. 
But for now, you must hurry. Athens needs you. But how did you know I was? Athena isn't the only god keeping watch on you, Spartan. Complete your task, Kratos, and the gods will forgive your sins. Don't believe them. The gods are all assholes. I legitimately do wonder who he is, though. I don't remember if the game ever tells you that. It might. I might just be forgetting it, but, like... Obviously, he's working for somebody. Somebody that's not Athena. Is he working for... Are we allowed to go back down? Huh, we are. Is he working for Hades, I wonder? Is it Hades that told him, like, where we would be? I don't... I don't know. If it's not Athena, it's obviously not the one we're trying to kill. Oh, we're not allowed to go back. Fair enough. Like, who is that dude? Nothing around here but a couple of health. The refills, which we'll gladly accept. Yeah, it's probably a good thing that we didn't try and finish it last stream. Mr. Noodle, you're still around. Surprised you're not asleep. But yeah, because we've been going, what, an hour this time? Oh shit, we're on the wrong spell. That sucked. That hurt us. Oh man, my dodge rolls though. Dodge rolled in completely the wrong direction. You know what? It's fine. We'll just kill him the cheesy way. And these hammer dudes. Why not? Just, <laughs> just kill everybody with magic. It's fine. I hate the hammer cent centaurs? Minotaurs. That's what they're called. The axe ones and whatnot aren't too bad, but the hammer ones, because they're stupid ground pound that sent out the shockwave. Ugh. You said it was for I was obviously joking. <laughs> you can take a nap if you're sleepy, love. Okay, we did spend literally all of our magic on that, though, so... Oh, hi. Why are you here? I'd prefer if you weren't. You can give me some magic. Thank you for that. No, oh my god, screw you guys. I greatly dislike Gorgons. No, grab this one, you dummy. Oh, what? I mean, I know I'm not good at these types of QTEs, obviously, after that one boss fight, but like... I didn't think I fucked it up that time. No oh well. Let's see, this is a good use for... Oh my lord. Oh my god, <laughs> if I can... Bruh, I literally can't even hit them with it. They're so fast with their stupid arrows. My lord, that ate up most of our magic that we just got. Um, Probably gonna have to take the health, honestly. Because we're like really low on, well, everything, but 
useful as magic is, not dying is the priority. <laughs> Oh my god, I hate these guys so much! Okay, that was close enough that time, please. If you're close enough, you can block it. This is probably a waste. These guys are not strong enough to warrant Rage of the Gods. I'm gonna end up regretting that. I know it. Uh, the garden. Do we just go across? I don't remember where we're going. There's nothing else like here now, right? That we should be finding? No secrets from earlier in the game that we could have possibly missed? Like... A new platform from all the destruction, none of that. No, okay. Way to waste more magic, my guy. That was, that was good. <laughs> it clearly said R2, my guy, not L2. I'm an idiot. Ooh. Experience chest. Probably not enough to level up though. We need 3,750. Close, but no. Refills though? That's amazing. Thank you, game. I mean, it's super cheap to level up. Did we just I think we just do it. Screw the blade Artemis. Might of Zeus. Hold L2 and hold triangle. Who wants a charge attack? We probably don't have enough to do it though, right? Nah, I'm a s I'm guessing we don't have enough and that's why it's not letting us like complete it. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. We have it now, I guess. Kratos had traversed the desert of lost souls, bested the deadly traps of Pandora's temple, and escaped Hades itself. There was but one task left. Zeus! Do you see now what your son can do? You cast your favor on Athena, but her city lies in ruins before me. And now, even Pandora's box is mine! Would you have me use it against Olympus itself? Kratos returned even from the underworld. Is this the best you can do, father? You send a broken mortal to defeat me, the god of war? <laughs> oh. Maybe stop with all your daddy issues and <laughs> focus on that useless mortal. The power of the gods unleashed. You are still just a mortal. Every bit as weak as the day you begged me to save your life. I am not the same man you found that day. The monster you've created has returned to kill you. You have no idea what a true monster is, Kratos. Your final lesson is at hand. It's weird how, like, the blades spawn out of our, or not spawn, but are like stuck to our back, right? But like, we can pull them out at will, which is all fine and dandy, but like, the blades are not connected to our wrists until we take them out, or off our back, I guess? It's weird. 
Also, this dude has a ton of health. And he deals a lot of damage. This is this is not this is not good. I definitely should have kept the Rage of the Gods. Oh good, he drops a little bit incrementally. Oh, that was rude. Okay. So is that a phase two specific thing? Can we block it? We can. What I really need to watch for is if he has any unblockable attacks. <laughs> and also need to just not get hit because oh, holy crap oh. do deal some damage oh god I was scared there for a second man I was like is the game really like just gonna die um okay so these are the final two experience chests I don't have any way to build up Rage of the Gods, because all the enemies are dead. So I literally can't power that up, so let's just do this. I wonder how well Hades, the army of Hades, would do against him. I'm wondering, like, if it would help stun him for a second. It's just the Rage of Poseidon is so hard to beat, because it offers us invulnerability while it's going off it hits a bunch like oh okay so he can break through our block somehow okay wow that sucked okay <laughs> it's fine we're gonna try again but the army of hades did more damage than the Rage of Poseidon did by by a lot. It just doesn't offer us the invulnerability or anything, so we gotta like be careful to block. And oh hi, Kratos, you turn, but too late. Ares has taken Athens. There is no more hope. No hope. I didn't realize we could talk to you. Um, I mean, I'm gonna take the chests, even though it's kind of pointless at this point and definitely taking these ones and if army of hades is going to do that much damage then i definitely think it's the way to start power this up because why not kratos Bro, that does so much damage. That's so good. Oh shit, we don't have enough for another one though. Okay, so the overhead attack is the one that seems to break our guard. That one. I need to watch for that. If that's the only attack that can break our guard, though, then that's not too bad. Nope, that's the one. <laughs> you don't have much time to dodge out of the way of that. Holy hell. But Army of Hades does a crap ton of damage. That's good. That's good. That gives us... That gives us something. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know for sure what it gives us, but it gives us something. Uh, I'm gonna skip. It's, it doesn't matter if we collect this stuff. To the best of my memory, the, there is no, like, actual new game plus. It's just costumes. 
you can like play again but with costumes or whatever so i don't think we need to worry about maxing out Traitors as much as possible before the end good job And do it again, yeah. Gotta, gotta notice patterns here and again. I'm trying to stay close because I think he's less likely to do that overhead attack when we're close. I think could be completely wrong though. I need to learn to actually, like, recognize the overhead attack, though. Because I don't know what it looks like when he decides to do it. I really was hoping we would have gotten enough magic back by now to use the Army of Hades again. But no luck. a sick hammer man i wish we could like get his hammer we get his armor for the second game which is cool i really enjoy playing the game with his with his armor i think it gives us like increased health or defense or something um but i want the hammer with that like the head of of who was that is that cerberus it looks like one of the heads of cerberus or something on it like Stop attacking for like two seconds, my guy. I mean, if his AI wants to stay in the same loop, I guess we'll win eventually. Mm, this is not good for us. Oh, we're fine. What's he doing? Can we block that? We cannot block that. We cannot block that at all. Holy hell. We're dead. Bruh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> knowledge. We gain knowledge. Whenever he decides to jump up in the air and do the, the shooty thing at us, we cannot block that. The only way we can do, or the only thing we can do is run the hell away. I'm guessing dodge rolls. Dodge rolls are the way to go. Maybe this time we'll collect a little more magic too. We got a bunch of health. After like the first bit, but I like no health for, or no magic for some reason. health again it looks like he drops a bunch of magic but I guess it must not actually be all that much nice okay I'm gonna wait until we take a hit to use it again though because it's an almost guaranteed health drop using army of hades it's does so much damage like if we can stay tucked in this little nook over here that would be perfect chocobo welcome my guy oh no we're out of the nook 
I like that nook. It kept us close to each other. This is the bad attack. Ow. Can't see what's going on. <laughs> Of course, we instantly got hit with the unblockable attack again, so that was good. Oh, that was bad. That was bad. Uh, this is only like the fifth try or something like that. It hasn't been that long. It's been a minute, but not, not like super long. Probably like... Uh, no, we don't want to switch to easy mode. Probably like 15 minutes for it, I guess. And half of that's been this loading screen, because for some reason the game takes a minute to load here. <laughs> Honestly, this health chest feels pretty much useless. We get so much health from him, just from using the Army of Hades the first time or two. Which actually brings up another good point. We probably shouldn't use the Army of Hades right away, like I've been doing. We should probably save the Army of Hades. I need to learn to recognize that attack. I was gonna say until we lose a bit of health, but of course, <laughs> we instantly lost a bunch of health this time, so. We dodged it. We got hit by one of the more predictable attacks, but we dodged it. <laughs> oh. I'm getting greedy now, though. I need to not do that. Hello! Just in time for the finale, you two, hopefully. I guess to be determined. Oh man, that was a bad time to look at chat. Yes, I am playing something after. Uh, as far as your message about work, I don't remember seeing it. I may have, but I honestly don't remember. Okay, that didn't get you to a health spawn, which is upsetting. I was hoping it would. We could really use a health spawn right about now. Yeah, I don't know what we're playing after yet. We'll roll for it after the credits roll on this game. Assuming we beat this game in the next two hours, that is. <laughs> I think we will. We've gotten pretty close a handful of times. He just, he does some massive damage. Like, it's insane. Are we allowed to talk about it on stream, my guy? It's up to you. I'm going to look at it real quick. Uh... Nice, man. You're not... Okay, yeah. <laughs> we won't talk about it then, but like... <laughs> wild. I just read it real quick, because I you piqued my curiosity. I really, really wish we had Rage of the Gods, or just a way to get Rage of the Gods. Because the extra damage that would give us is wild, man. Like... Bro, what a start. The one problem with the Army of Hades thing is you can't freaking see 
when it's going on. Like, okay, well, that was <laughs> that was a garbage run. It's fine. We'll just pretend that one didn't happen. Bro was supposed to take out the garbage for me that night. Never got to. Was a little too busy doing something else, I guess. Yeah, man. You know, got to keep your priorities straight. Okay, well, the game's taken pity on us and has given us full health. <laughs> but, like, Blade of Artemis? You know what? Screw it. We'll try it. It's not powered up. I don't have enough to power it up, even with the stuff up there. But screw it. We'll give it a try. Why not, man? <laughs> but the real problem is, is how bad I am at dodging that specific attack. I need... To recognize when he's about to do the overhead like pound thing and blo uh, not block it dodge it it's unblockable it does nothing yeah pretty much <laughs> <laughs> If it was fully powered up, I'm sure it would do okay, but it's not, and I have no way to power it up at this point, so I think we're going to have to give up on the Blade of Artemis. <laughs> to be fair, the uh, the Chains of Olympus don't do a whole lot either, or what, we don't have the Chains of Olympus right now. They're the Chains of Blades of Chaos, that's what we have. Changes from game to game, it's hard to keep track of. Um, they don't do much damage either. The only thing that really does damage to this guy, like, a bunch, is, uh, the Army of Hades here. Kratos. I thought the Rage of Poseidon would do better than it did, but no. Bro, I hit the joystick that time to dodge. That was bullshit. As long as we don't mess up this part, like the beginning stages of the fight, it's not that big of a deal, because the dude drops a lot of health when he gets around halfway. Yeah, see, we're already almost back up to full health. That was dumb, that was dumb. The army of Hades, though, man. That's the real goat, man. It's wild how much damage it does compared to, like, the Blades of Chaos here or whatever. Oh, that was dumb. I let go. Nope, 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 okay. Oh, I thought I screwed up. You never notice? Never notice what? How much damage it does, or like... Oh, is it really? I never noticed that either. That's pretty sick. I was thinking it was like the head of uh, one of the heads of Cerberus or something. That's kind of what it made me think of. Plus like the whole breathing fire thing and all that. But, but that's pretty cool. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if he was working both sides. I don't remember all of the, the lore about it, but... That seems like something, you know, he would do. Screwed up that block, but the beginning stage of this attack doesn't do much damage. It's really the fire part you gotta worry about with this one. I'd rather not. I'd rather you beg for yours. Nope, that's not the attack I thought it was. <laughs> I thought he was getting ready to do overhead. And 
about halfway there. That's fine, we're fine. That was overhead. That attack does so much damage, man. Instantly does it again, man. He's so close now. Okay, this part. Just keep dodging, just keep dodging, because we can't block. Okay, no, 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 no. Just get enough magic for another... For another thingy, please. Let's go. Let's go. Grab him. No, it was up, it was up, it was up. Okay, grab him. Oh shit, it's a, it's a battle. It's a circle battle, okay, okay. That makes sense. Grab him. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so glad the next prompt was a circle because I was too busy mashing it to notice. Oh, buddy. GG indeed. that had haunted Kratos for the past 10 years had now taken form and substance. His past stood before him. Kratos! What's happening? Where are we? By the gods, can this be real? We have to fight again? I don't remember. <laughs> Daddy! Ares! There is nothing you can put in my way to stop me. I will save my family. Oh, I guess so. Uh, maybe we should have grabbed that other stuff. We could have powered up a little bit. Um, yeah, whatever. Blades of Artemis it is. Did it give us a magic upgrade before it? I don't remember. Or not upgrade, but a magic refill. Now I feel dumb for not grabbing those things. We might have had enough to refill. Keep O press to hug your family. Hugging your family will transfer your life into them. Oh, okay. I do not remember this part literally at all, man. Oh shit, I don't have enough magic. Ah! Get him off me! Oh my god, there's so many of them! This is not cool! Oh my god, dudes. <laughs> We're gonna die. <laughs> Shit. I, I don't remember this part. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hopefully, I mean, surely there's a checkpoint after the the fight with Ares, though, right? Okay, yeah. Wow, 
Why did that take so much of our magic? Our magic was full, and now it's empty. My lord, dude, they're about to die again. Yes. Give them my health. Oh, no, get up. Wait, what's the one back there doing? Bro. <laughs> God. I thought that was it. What is this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We failed. I know. <sighs> oh, our magic isn't full. Okay. It's high, but it's not full. That's why we can only do it once. Oh my god. Can I grab these dudes? I can. Oh my god, these dudes suck so much. <laughs> They're gonna die again. What happens if we just give them all of our health? Will the game even let us do that? Wait, does giving them our health refill our Rage of the Gods? Something's refilling it fairly quickly. Damn, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I actually think... Going back to the Rage of Poseidon is probably the way to go. Just because of the number of people. And it uses less magic. Give her... Yes. Give her stuff. It does! Giving her health does refill our stuff. I mean, it's not going to do us much good, though, when we're dead.
Get up, Kratos. Kratos, hug your family. Bro. Oh, my lord. I don't know how I forget this section with that, how much we're struggling with it. I would think I would remember this. Okay, I'm thinking use it early, give her a bunch of health. that we can try to get it again. Wait, get off. Okay. I don't think we have enough health. I don't know if it's a hard mode thing or what, but I don't think we have enough health to get a refill on our Rage of the God meter thing. She takes so much damage from these dudes, too. Like... How long do these dudes spawn for? She's about to die. No! We were so close to the refill, too. Okay, initially when I said I don't know if we're going to beat it tonight or if it's going to take two hours, I was joking. But now I'm kind of serious, man. I, I, don't, I don't know. Holy shit, she's already about to die. No, get off her. Use the magic, dumbass. Now hover. Oh shit, we don't have enough. <laughs> I was hoping, I was really hoping we could get Rage of the Gods again, but... Surprise that hasn't asked us about easy mode yet. I guess the game doesn't <laughs> want us to do easy mode here? I don't know. Dude, the grab is like insta-kill on them, which is nice. But it doesn't protect her at all. No, don't grab yet. Don't grab yet. Don't grab yet. Oh, she died. Damn. I was trying to cut it close so we could refill, but...
See, we take more hits when we use regular attacks. But she takes more hits whenever we grab. Because obviously grabbing only stuns one of them at a time. I have to give her health or I'm gonna or she's gonna die. This is <laughs> this is something else. Um, also, I kind of forgot. I should probably. There we go. Do that. All right. Try again. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what else to do. It's weird that the game gives us like full health whenever we die a bunch without winning, but it doesn't give us um full magic. Is this the best AoE attack that we have? Like, we need to keep people off of her, but there's just so many of them. The only thing I can really use that does it is Poseidon's Rage, but we can only use that so many times. Oh shit, I thought it was the other way around. I thought I had a hold of him, not them a hold of me. Get off her, please. I want to magic while we have it. I think we died that time. I don't know what what to do. Guess we could try Blades Artemis. <laughs> we haven't tried it yet. It won't hurt anything. It's not like we're doing well without it, so why not? Maybe it'll like cut them in half in one hit or something. Do they have like any better AoE? No, it has like the spinny attack, but I don't know if that's really any better than the AoE we were already using. I mean, at the very least, it's not any worse. I don't think. Just focus on me. If they would just focus on me. Hold on, what about the Gorgon thing? How do we do... How do we do the Gorgon Flash?
No oh, shit, we're still stuck. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? I didn't even know we could fall off the edge. That was a new way to lose. All right, hold on. Move list. Um. No, that's options. Uh, how do we get to the move list? It's been a while. There we go. Not Blades of Chaos. Poseidon's Trident. No. Rage of the Gods. None of this. Medusa's Gaze. Hold L2 and hold Circle. Oh, that used literally all of our magic. And I'm guessing we need a fair amount of magic to make that work, yeah. Okay, so powerful, but no. Leave my wife alone, you creeps. She's not even real. Why are we working so hard to save her? I wish we at least had like some sort of bar to say like how close we were. Cause I have no idea, man. We might not even be close to winning this encounter yet. God, I'm gonna die. Yep, this is it. Oh, God. Wife's about to get murdered. Just hug her. Just don't do anything. Just hold our wife as we die. Does the stab move with Artemis work? What's the stab move? Do you remember how to do it or did you see it in the list? And that throws a couple people up in the air. That's like super generic. R1. Problem is, would it be... Oh, damn. We'll try it again. We'll give it a proper try now that I know. Does it... AoE. Because that's what I really feel like we need here, right? Uh, give it a fair share. We'll go ahead and do what upgrade we can on it real quick. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Blade power increase. Very nice. Okay, bring it out. And then... See, I don't think it's a big enough AoE to keep people away from her. Although, maybe. Yeah, not really. <laughs> because from what I remember of playing the game, I never really used any other weapons than... than the blades. The blades were just too OP. The blades of chaos. I feel like what we were doing was probably our best bet. Just murdering as many people as possible with uh with the rage of Poseidon here.
Although there is one thing I think would help. Maybe if we did that and then... Because the magic is free right now anyways. That was a waste. That was a waste. No, oh my god, whatever. If they would aggro me, it would probably be fine. Like, I think I can deal with them. It's just they deal so much damage to my wife, man. Like, right now they're all aggroed on me, but that's not gonna last. See, they're already aggroed on her again. Okay, I have to give her health or she's gonna die. Oh shit, we're dead. We're dead! <laughs> oh my god. How'd we fall? I know the one time we fell because the, the whatchamacallit, the, the ground fell out from under us, but how did we fall that time? That was jank. God, they like have no stun on them either, man. I mean, like, they do get stunned sometimes, but you gotta hit them with a pretty late combo to actually stun them. It still used our magic. Stop attacking the wife. Don't die, wife. Don't die. No, please. Yes, game. I Trust me, I know at this point how healing the wife works. She instantly, she takes so many hits. <laughs> God. Like, as soon as we stopped hugging her, she's just dead again. You know what this calls for? This calls for some chunky. Time to reload. <laughs> Just start the game again from the beginning. Problem solved. What I'm really surprised by is that it hasn't offered us the chance to go to easy mode. I don't think I'd want to anyways, but the fact that it hasn't is wild. See, like, why aren't they getting stunned? I'm hitting the hell out of them. If I stay away from my family, they won't, like... Yeah, no, they, they still gladly attack her. Hmm... All right, let's see here. God of War, final fight. Uh, God of War 2005. <laughs> Second phase of the final boss? Is this it? Yeah. Uh, no.
90% luck, 10% skill. Um, <laughs> uh... <laughs> this guy said, you just keep going and eventually it stops. Make sure to protect your family so their health doesn't drop and get good at juggling and fast combos with the blades. Um... Uh, he's up your magic. Uh, really useful. Yeah. Hugging your wife also regenerates your Spartan Rage. I know this, but uh. Huh. Yeah, there's really no, like, legit strategy. The strategy is just kind of get lucky and hope for the best. How do I not remember this fight, bro? The only real strategy was to do this a bunch. Which kind of works, because it throws them up in the air. But you still got to get kind of lucky. I mean, so far, it's the best luck we've had yet. Until they just randomly decide not to get thrown in the air. Like, okay. We're getting to the point where our wife's, like, getting hurt. Hold on. I love when they decide they don't want to get juggled. That's great. Okay, Poseidon's raid. Now that that dude's spawning back there, I want to get some Army of the Dead in here. I'm hoping Army of the Dead will deal with that dude in the back. Which it seemed like it did. Definitely need to give wife some health. Bro, she dies like almost instantly. <laughs> We've almost got another use of Poseidon, or not Poseidon's Rage, another use of uh, whatchamacallit though. Of Rage of the Gods, awesome. Bro, is that it? Holy shit. Oh. <laughs> See, that's all we needed. Some chunky. You'll never have them again. You cannot save them, Kratos. You gave them up in your quest for ultimate power. There is a price to pay for everything you gain. Not that price. I didn't want them to die. No price is too high for what I offered. And you rejected me. A god! Now, you will have no power. No magic! All that is left for you is death! Oh. Oh. Not. Not again. You should have joined me, Kratos. You should have been stronger. By the gods. The battle was not over. The gods, it seemed, had a final gift for Kratos. I 
still have I don't remember. Do we have to fight again? Now, is there a phase three? How strong I am. Oh god, there's a phase three. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Our magic carried over. That's pretty sick. Wait, was I not blocking that? Why was I not blocking that? Oh, this is like a tug of war match. Interesting. Okay. You cannot defeat me, Oh wait, is he using Hades army? That's not very nice. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. I don't remember this. I kind. I vaguely remember this phase. Wait, what was that? That wasn't nice. <laughs> we didn't even get a hit on him. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, what combos do we have? Is we have the basic attack, of course. How do we still get hit? Circle is doing something. I'm just trying to figure out how to play with the sword right now. Okay, I think the best thing to do is just get close and try to beat him. Like, beat on him. Because with it being like a tug-of-war thing, right? We need... We need the health more than anything. If we guard... Because, like, we were outside of it, but we still get hit. Or still got hit. So maybe we need to be outside of it and guarding? He broke our guard, didn't he? Oh, now it gives us the option for easy mode. That's so weird, though. Like, it gives the option to us now, but not on that last fight. Okay, so he has, like, a magic blast thing that... What? Can I just not dodge that? Or, like, block that at all? We have to jump? Okay, jumping might have done it. What's the tell for that? For that, like, magic blast that he does. So he, like, pulls his hand back. Oh, good question. I don't know. It does. Oh, my God. The stupid unblockable, though. <laughs> but it's a really good thing we didn't try to beat this the last time we played. The unblockables, though. Oh, yeah, we were kind of in a bad spot there. I hit dodge, but I must have been too slow. No, I'm not switching to easy mode yet. I'm, I'm glad it keeps giving us the option. I hope it keeps giving us the option. I'd really appreciate if he had stopped blocking. 
Oh shit, circle? Nice. Uh, I thought I was clear of it. No. <laughs> we got close. <laughs> we just need one good run. That's all we need. Preferably where he doesn't start with that. Can we hit him while he's charging this? Uh, <laughs> technically, we could get like one or two hits, but then we have to get the hell out of there. Okay, well... <laughs> we're not dead? I thought we were dead. <laughs> this game's bullshit. I love this game, but this game's bullshit. <laughs> you test my patience, Spartan. Man, okay. Should I just be trying to dodge roll instead of blocking in general damn maybe I, I I don't think jumping's actually the way. I think we just have to be like a certain distance from it whenever it lands. I'm not ready to switch to easy mode yet. If we're still doing it at 9 o'clock, we might give in, but... You're a bastard, you know that? Oh my god, I'm dead. <laughs> I, can't, I can't get out of the way of that stupid little blast he does. Oh, there's little people running around on the, the dam or whatever. The wall, dam, whatever that's meant to be. Oh my god. Feels so slow whenever we're uh, trying to dodge roll out of the way of that. Okay, standing in the middle is probably the best thing to do, and then. Blocking, no point in going farther. Oh, damn it. Bro, if we could have dodged that and then just had it happen again. Like, get lucky with that, that sword clash twice in a row. We would be, like, good to go. But for some reason, I'm failing to dodge that stupid thing. Hey, we dodged... Well, okay. <laughs> we kind of dodged it. Nope. Not switching to easy mode game. Suck a dick. <laughs> oh.
Come on, game. Okay, this should uh, not even us out, but it'll get us closer to even again. Okay, I want to stand like back here and then, yeah. Nope, I saw the hand, but I couldn't get out of the way in time. And then run to the side. Uh, it's a different, it's phase three. Uh, hard mode is much harder than I remember. Ah, oh, wait, what? Why'd he like automatically win the match up there? That was weird. Yeah, phase one, relatively easy. Phase two, sucked ass. <laughs> phase three seems like it's going to be... I'm sure there's a good strat for it. But as far as it goes for me, it seems like it's going to basically come down to luck. <laughs> we just have to have one QTE take place twice in a row. Or at least close to twice in a row. Without him doing that unblockable bullshit right there. Okay, so if we keep attacking when he's... When he's, uh, guarding... He, like, auto-wins the duel. <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. That's good info. Okay, this. This is the QT. If we just have this happen roughly twice in a row. Good. Good, good, good. So far, so good. We wait here. Yup, yup, yup. Now he's probably going to do the hand thing next. Yep. I was meant to dodge that, but, you know. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not switching. Get over it. Ah, oh, so we do actually have to run to the side. I thought maybe just being in the back would be enough for that, but nope. <laughs> Are you going to do the hand thing? What are you going to do? Yes, you are. Like, even though I know it's coming, I just cannot dodge it, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> God. How did I do this on very hard back in the day? I must have been so much better at games when I was a kid. Which, I mean, is definitely a thing, you know? People tend to be better at games when they're younger, but... He's gonna do the hand thing. I know for a fact he's... Oh wait, he didn't do it this time. Oh my god, I suck. Oh, he's doing the army of Hades, though. So, how you guys doing tonight, Chocobo? How things been going? Optijack, how are you, my guy? Don't know if you're still around, Nate, but uh, 
How's, how's the family? Dinner? Whatever you're up to. We might be in this one for a minute. I need I need a drink I haven't drank in weeks because I've been sick <laughs> but I need a drink <laughs> oh my god Question of the day, you're shrunk down to the size of a penny. What's the first thing you do? See, that's bullshit. Because whenever he does the, the army of Hades, you have to stay blocked until they disappear. Otherwise, you're just fucked, as far as I can tell. So if he does the unblockable attack while the army of Hades is going on, you're just dead. Anyways... Uh, first thing I do if I'm shrunk down to the size of a penny, probably try to figure out why the hell I'm shrunk down to the size of a penny. <laughs> uh, after that, though, I don't know, shelter, food, water, right? The basics? <laughs> you know, try, try to survive. I'm just thinking grounded, you know? That's what I'm thinking at that point. If I'm the size of a penny, then... I'm going to try to figure out some survival basics and then uh, train some fucking ants to be my, my, my workforce. I'm not trying to do a combo there like that, bro. Panic? I mean, panic is fair. That's that's actually a fair one, yeah. <laughs> that's that's the realistic answer, right? Like that's that's what we'd probably actually do. Ah, oh, damn it. I didn't realize that was a three-part combo. And then he goes into that one. Oh, we were close, man. This will get us a little bit of health back. But it's only enough for like one hit, so it's not really all that great. <laughs> what about you, Optijack? You still here? What's the first thing you're doing? Oh, I forgot about the follow-up. Okay, well, this is RNG moment. This is the longest we've survived. That's saying something. We're not winning, but... Okay, stay back here. Make him come to us. There we go, dude. This should give us the upper hand. It's not enough to win. Let's die, you dick. Stay back here. Damn it, he did it. 
I was hoping he wouldn't do it. He didn't the last two times. All right, time for RNG. I quit too early. Quit guarding too early, that is. That time he does that, man. Every other time he did the sword swipe. So I was like, okay, I'll just I'll just wait and then I'll block instead of doing the thing. Instead of jumping. But of course the, the one time we block is when he decides he doesn't want to fucking do the sword swing and wants to do the other thing instead. Oh, Optijack playing some Hitman, huh? Sorry to just, like, shout your business out like that, but you've been enjoying it? I'm not a Hitman fan myself. Just can't get into them. I played one of them on PS2, and yeah. Wasn't for me. I don't think it's a bad game or anything. It's just I'm not a huge stealth person to begin with, and those games are, like, especially slow. First one is hard AF, but I like the PS2 ones. Never played the newest trilogy. I've heard a lot of good things about the newest trilogy, but I've never played. It. I only played one of them on PS2, and even then, I didn't play a ton. Just you know, a bit, like two hours worth or whatever. Never got that far in it. I'm not good at them either. Probably doesn't help the not liking them thing. Bro, this could be it. This could be it. I don't know if it's going to do enough or not, but it's, it's by far the closest we've got. Okay, it's not enough. We just need one more volley. Okay, we wait. See what he does. He's not pulling back. That's good. Bro, this is it. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Get wrecked, Ares, you bastard. <laughs> I who uh, saved you in your time of greatest need. I haven't forgotten, Ares. I remember how you saved me. That night. I was trying to make you a great warrior. You succeeded. <laughs> oh, man. Sucks to be you, Ares. GG, my guys. Actually, GG this time. Holy hell. Yes, actual GGs. <laughs> Kratos had done me impossible. A mortal defeating a god. Ares was no more. Thank goodness, man. Like a nuke just freaking went off over there. The city had been saved. Kind of. Thrive again. That he's kind of destroyed, but for Kratos, for as he sought to rebuild his soul with the help of the gods, the truth was revealed to him. Athena, rid me of the memories that haunt me still. You have done well, Kratos. Though we mourn the death of our brother, the gods are indebted to you. We promised your sins would be forgiven, and so they are. But we never promised to take away your nightmares. No man, no god could ever forget the terrible deeds you have done. In the end, knowing the visions of his past would never leave him, Kratos made his way to the bluffs overlooking the Aegean Sea. 
The gods of Olympus have abandoned me. They really did just screw him over so hard, now man. Like, no did everything they asked, and took care of Ares, and then was just like, ah, it sucks to be you, but you'll never forget what you've done. After ten years of suffering, ten years of endless nightmares, it would finally come to an end. Death would be his escape from madness. The fate of Kratos was not as it seemed. The gods had other plans. Born aloft like a feather, Kratos found himself risen from the sea and placed on solid earth. You will not die this day, Kratos. The gods cannot allow one who has performed such service to perish by his own hand. Ares' tactics were brutal. His path of destruction had to be stopped. But now there is an empty throne in Olympus, and a new god of war is needed. Take these stairs, Kratos. They lead to your ultimate reward. Athena's Blades. Let's go, dude. I wonder when they did this. Did they know they were going to make another game? While your demons still haunt you, the gods have decreed you will not die this day. It's like, obviously, the Blades of Athena is what you get in the second game. So the fact they didn't just go, like, straight into the, the end here and instead had you... Like, did the whole thing with getting the, the blade and everything. I wonder if they knew and were just, like, setting up the second one. Let me see the bloodied sword used to kill Ares, the god of war. Your battles, are at an battles are at an end. I don't remember if they shine golden like that in the second game or not, though. Mount Olympus. Walk up here, find Zeus, just murder him now. Make the rest of the series a lot quicker, man. <laughs> like... Final save. Oh, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> just had to show off my magic a little bit before we ended it, you know? And I think we got everything. I don't think we missed anything. I'm pretty sure that was a completion run. Finally free of your servitude to this insane war or god of war. Gaze upon the bones of your defeated foe. It's the throne of the god of war. Take your rightful place upon it. There we go, From dude. That point forward, throughout the rest of time, whenever men rode forth to battle for good cause or for evil, they did so under the watchful eye of the man who had defeated a god. I doubt it. <laughs> It'd be Kratos, cool, though. The mortal who had become the new god of war. All right, you have conquered God of War. Let's go. Gonna let the credits play. Um, after the credits play, we'll figure out what we're playing. I don't know if we have time to do anything tonight, but tomorrow. Treasures of Olympus have been unlocked. God mode has been unlocked. I don't think we're going to be playing through again on God Mode anytime soon. I'm obviously not <laughs> as good as I used to be at this game. So that just sounds like absolute torture. Uh, I'm going to grab some chapstick though because I have a spot that's like dried and split open over here.
So I'll be right back while the, the credits play. I can find camera. There we go. I like when I went to sit down, my pinky got caught on the arm of the chair and almost broke my damn pinky. Oh man. I'd like to thank a bunch of people directors of tools, technology, and service, music director, sound design manager, music supervisors. Oh, yeah, while this is playing, we might as well go ahead and get any votes we have in. <laughs> or actually, I guess we don't have any legit votes in at the moment besides that one re4 i'm still gonna pull up the list here though um doo -doo 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 -doo. so we can see what all the options are in case anybody has last minute votes or anything and capture card there we go Can see both at the same time yeah everything's good okay uh okay so games to complete we got a vote for re4 from chocobo throw that in now the 254 all right so we have dot hack infection part one with six votes probably not gonna happen but technically possible bully with 14 Call of Duty 3 with none, Crash Bandicoot Twin Sanity, Tag Team Racing, Dark Cloud, that one's uh, fun, Dawn of Mana, I can understand why it doesn't have a ton of votes, but I like the mana games, Dead Space, ton of fun, Devil May Cry 2, of course, trying to play through those games eventually, Dragon Quest 8, not sure it's a great streaming game, but I like it, Eternal Ring, a very early From Software game, um, it's interesting. <laughs> Fable, Nate's been voting on that, or was voting on that. I think he's kind of forgot about it at this point, though. Otherwise, I'm sure it would have a bunch more votes than what it currently has, because he's been wanting us to play through that for a long time. Final Fantasy Tactics and Tactics Advance, of course. All the Final Fantasy VII games. Is it done? Kratos will return. There we go, dude. Oh, loading. I guess that's it. Uh, Final Fantasy X-2 and 12, Genji Don the Samurai, God of War 2018. You forgot it was on the list? I figured as much. <laughs> God of War 2018 is one that I do want to play. I'm not going to enable... Well, I'm going to go ahead and enable God of War 2, but if it by some chance rolls God of War 2, I'm not going to uh, take it. I don't usually play the same series back-to-back, -back, so if God of War 2 gets rolled, we're going to skip it. Uh, Grand Theft Auto... Harry Potter, Harvest Moon, Haven, Call of the King. Again, I understand why it doesn't have any votes, but I just... Because of the... Uh... Oh, yeah, that's fine, man. We can do that for you. I'll do that now before I forget. So that'll go up to 29. And there's your 25 votes gone. Uh, what was I saying, though? Oh, it's because of the video I saw of, like, how you can switch from, like, ground to air and all that stuff in Haven Call of the King. That's the only reason I really want to play that game. Um, because it was just, like, a PS2 game that had interplanetary travel on... I almost called it a ship. A uh, spaceship, I guess. Whatever. Horizon Zero Dawn, Eco Shadow of the Colossus, and Yasha. The Jack games, of course. Jack 2 is a front runner, Not the first, but up there. Jack 2, Killzone, all the Kingdom Hearts games, specifically Rechain of Memories next. Mass Effect has a fair bit of votes at 204. Medal of Honor, Mortal Kombat, SpongeBob SquarePants with no votes, but it's a fun game. Pac-Man World 2, same thing. Persona 3, 
that one singular vote. <laughs> or no, Persona 1 <laughs> with one singular vote. 3 has none because I want to play through them in order. Pets, Dogs 2, I still don't understand your guys' thing with that. Uh, <laughs> Pokemon Red, that's kind of in the middle of the pack. All the Prince of Persia, Ratchet & Clank games. Resident Evil 4 and Code Veronica. Scooby-Doo. Some games that probably won't ever get picked. Shaman King, Power of the Spirit. Shrek the Third's only really on there because it's super short and we played the other one. The Sims games. Sly 2 with only three votes, but Sly 2 and 3 I really want to play. Sonic games because they're Sonic games even though they're not particularly good. Spyro. Stardew Valley just because I freaking love Stardew Valley. There's no other real reason for it. Stuntman because it's fun. Tack. The Hobbit. Again, just something I want to beat. Last of Us, those ones are really good. Why? Oh, because I don't own The Last of Us Part 1. Or did I end up getting it? Hold on a second. I need to check. Did, did I end up getting The Last of Us Part 1? I feel like I did at some point. Maybe just forgot to update the list? I need to check my collection here. Search The Last of... Yeah, I have it. <laughs> oh. For PlayStation 5, apparently. Uh, so that one can go to True now. And I guess this would be PlayStation 5 I'd be playing it on. The Last of Us Part 2 is a PS4 game, though. Not PlayStation 5, so I had those backwards. I mean, I'll be playing it on the PS5, but still. Lord of Rings, uh, more Sim stuff. Why are the Sims split? Oh, because that's Sims the... This is The Sims. That's dumb. All the Uncharted games, Xenosaga, Yu-Gi-Oh, and Ark the Lead. That's everything. No last minute votes anybody wants to get in? Other than switching your uh, null Fallout votes to Fable? Going once, going twice. All right, let's figure out what the hell we're playing next then, shall we? As always, the first one doesn't count. Just making that clear up front, but I click this pick a number button here, a random number pops up over here, that will cause one of these to highlight. Whichever the first one is that's picked is just an example though. So don't get your hopes up on the first one. Let's see what it is. It would be number 1161, which is Resident Evil 4. It's just as likely to roll it again. <laughs> so I'm sorry to Chocobo, but we're gonna turn it off, turn it back on and see what the hell it is. Uh, for realsies. I mean, Resident Evil 4 is one of the top. Resident Evil 4, Jack 2, I think, are the, the top two. Yeah, those are the only two with the over 200 votes. So it's a good chance it'll be one of them, but it could technically be any of the games that have at least one vote. Let's see what it actually is. I'm a little bit nervous for some reason. I don't know why. It is number... 1,350, which is <laughs> a game with one vote. It happens. It can happen, obviously. But it's another short one. Scooby-Doo, Night of 100 Frights. <laughs> I'm sure I'm sure Rue will be excited about that, at least. It's too bad Rue's not here right now. But uh, there we go. Scooby-Doo, Night of 100 Frights is what we'll be playing next. That's <laughs> the chances, man. It literally had a 1 in 1,420, nice number, uh, <laughs> chance of winning, and it did. So we only have about 35, 40 minutes. Do we want to get started? We could probably get through like the intro to the game, or do we just want to wait on it? Uh, in the meantime, though, God of War... Is true start it? Okay, my guy. <laughs> Scooby Doo Night of a. It was Night of a Hundred Frights, right? Uh, of course it. Oh, wait, that's the wrong list. Yeah, it changed, but whatever. It was, yeah, Night of a Hundred Frights. Hydrate? Oh, bro, I just put on Jack chapstick. Just redeemed hydrate. There you go. Tastes like garbage with the chapstick, but... <laughs> Alright, Scooby-Doo, Night of a Hundred Frights. I need to put that down before I forget what it is. scooby dooby doo where are you? Uh, why am I so blind, bro? Oh, because we played it before. That's why I'm so blind. 
R S Scooby Doo, Night of a Hundred Frights. Game to beat. Game to beat. All right. Well, I guess I'm gonna go find the game, pop it in, and we'll uh, get through the intro. Have it ready for. Well, Wednesday I won't be here, so the week after next. <laughs> yeah. So B R B, my guys. moves along and pushes us off too son of a bitch <laughs> okay uh that makes things slightly more complicated than i expected sorry we'll figure it out i assume there's some way to either turn it off or maybe we just have to wait for the right cycle there's got to be there's got to be some way around it 